FISU World University Games are now just four days away and in and around Lake Placid there have been plenty of questions about what kinds of road closures and parking restrictions there are going to be. North Country Bureau reporter Michael Miller breaks them down for us. Lake Placid will have road closures at a magnitude not seen since the 1980 Olympics. There are some areas you won't be able to drive even if you have a parking pass. Those are Olympic Drive, Hayes Street, the lower half of Marcy Road where it intersects with Main Street, and Main Street from Cummings Road to Parkside Drive in front of the Olympic Center. There are two portions of Main Street you'll only be able to drive if you have a parking pass. That's from Mirror Lake Drive to Cummings Road and from Parkside Drive to the southern entrance of the Grand Adirondack Hotel. Locals and visitors looking for parking without a parking pass are able to park at the Lake Placid Marina, the Lake Placid Golf Course, and here at the Horse Show Grounds where three different shuttle services will make regular stops and bring people downtown. At the horse show grounds, the shuttles will run 24 hours a day. At the marina and the golf course, they'll run from 6.30 a.m. to 9 p.m. The section of Main Street near the Grand Adirondack Hotel will be open one way between 2 a.m. and 10 a.m. for delivery trucks and people with parking passes. At Whiteface Mountain, no parking will be allowed in the river lot. A downtown business employee told me off camera they were worried about their ability to park at work. More than 400 parking passes were approved, so there may be more passes available than spaces. Reporting in Lake Placid, Michael Miller, ABC 22 News.